Hi. Today we're at the Carolina Renaissance Festival. We decided to come to the Renaissance Festival again this year. Uh, we come every single year. I think we've been doing it almost every year since, what, 2010 together? Almost, yeah. We both grew up coming here. I think we've only missed one year so far since we've been together, and we're really looking forward to it. There's a lot of fun things to do in there, a lot of good food. So we'll try some food, see some shows, and we're just really going to enjoy the day. Yeah. Also, not to mention, it's a perfect day here. It's beautiful outside. It's a sold out day here at the Renaissance Festival, but luckily Sarah got our tickets online yesterday, so we're just gonna be able to walk right in. First things first, I need a flower crown. We can already tell it's not that busy of a day compared to other years we've been here. It looks like they put limits on their reservations. We're gonna walk right in this first store and see if we can find Sarah a crown. Looks like we found some pretty crowns here. We had to walk back to the entrance to grab our map. All right, instead of a crown, Sarah's thinking about getting this mushroom hat that she's been seeing people wear. It's pretty unique. She gets a crown every year, so maybe switch it up this year. Yep, I'd say that's a winner. Turn around a little bit. Oh yeah, that's cool. All right, as we head in, we're gonna get to the pub and grab us a couple of drinks from the pile. All right, Sarah got a glass of Moscato. I got a nice pumpkin beer, so go tea. Mm, I love pumpkin beer. So today we are just chilling, walking around, and of course looking at shops that Sarah wants to look at. Anything that she says is cute, we're gonna go in there and look at it. Let's get one. <laughs> Look, it's basically just like Disney World. Yep, I see no difference here. It looks very safe. Steven got me this beautiful tie-dye rainbow rose. It's like real and fresh. Got some water here to keep it good while we're still just walking around. But it's so pretty. It's very pretty. And now you get to hold it all day. <laughs> all right, time to get some food and like I said at the beginning of the video we have been coming here for years and years and I have never seen a line this short at all. It is usually a completely crowded area right here that you can't even walk through. You don't even know where the line begins and today it looks like we have multiple choices so we're gonna grab some food. First line we're gonna jump on is the corn on the cob line. We decided to divide and conquer. Sarah's over there getting some corn on the cob, and I'm gonna pick up the chicken and chips. All right, they actually gave us two pieces of corn because she said that they were really small, so cheers. And of course, we got our chicken and chips here, which is just chicken fingers and french fries. <laughs> Good shots. I got some ones moving. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I just got done doing the Castle Siege paintball. I did the 20 paintballs for $6. It's kind of cool. You got the moving targets back there, so that's what I was going for. Why are you throwing so hard? <laughs> You're not casting a fishing pole. <laughs> I'm not a bass. You're not going to hit me either, apparently. Hey, you don't have to go so fast. We're not being intimate, sir. <laughs> Why are you always done first? I never know you started. <laughs>
you bled and bled. What's up, little guy in the green shirt? You got big ears, kid, holding that hat on pretty well, hey? Sarah said she has always liked these umbrellas, but she's already having to carry around this rose. <laughs> Shops, vendors, different performing arts, food, drinks, snacks. There's just a million different things you can do. Different shows, stages everywhere. So we've come here a bunch of times. So we've seen a lot of the different shows. So we're kind of just walking around, checking out, and enjoying this perfect weather. As long as I've been coming to the Renaissance Festival, I've always wanted to buy a sword, but I have no idea what I would even do with it. This fender is pretty cool. With all different kinds of metalwork. What drew us over here is a Jack and Sally one right there. Yeah, they got all kinds of cool stuff over here. I can hold it. Hello, hello. Hi, how are you? I got the honeymead. And Miss Sarah got the raspberry mead. Black raspberry mead. Cheers. Your ears back, and if you're science and technology type, I think you'll like it. It said, yuck it up, Neptune, you're next. Oh, you are so my people. Now, I'm also a relentless reader of t-shirts out here. And the, the reason is, is that I once saw a t-shirt that said, haikus are easy. Sometimes they do not make sense. Refrigerator. <laughs> if you weigh less than 150 pounds, you can ride a camel. A tradition for Sarah here is to grab one of the pickles. And of course, they also have some beef teriyaki sticks, some beef jerky, and some beef sticks. I got a pickle, I got a pickle, I got a pickle, Let's get your review. That's a good pickle. That's a good pickle. And the staple of the Renaissance Festival is about to begin, which is the Jousting Death Tournament. And we've got some jets flying over us as well to get the show started. Looks like you choose which side you want to be on. Which night? Right next to the jousting tournament is your free petting farm. They've got all kinds of animals you can pet in there. For five dollars you can get a pet feed cup. And of course we've got all the animals. Sarah's so in on these black and white ones down there. They look so cute. I'm sorry guys, we didn't get the cup. We didn't get the cup. They know who paid the five dollars. So they look for the scraps on the outside of the fence. Expecting some messy eaters. He is giving me the stare. Do you want us or do you want our food? Huh? Huh? Got some small cows here. Some giant ears. Sure, but they're a lot bigger than everything else in here. Are you a llama? Oh, they're so cool. And again, we got some beggars. 
I think Sarah could stay in here all day. I want to take them all home. <laughs> This happens every year. We get bored waiting for the jousting to start, so we're gonna carry on. <laughs> they take forever. We're just like, can the jousting start now? Like, we stop cheering? I don't know. Which takes forever. You cheer for the same nights over and over again, and then they never kill each other. Come on. <laughs> Another thing I've always wanted, but I'll never buy, is a drinking horn. The belly dancers are on. we come here. distracted because probably of this mood right here. Yeah, it's just pretty artwork. It's like you really unique. It's, it's pretty cool. A lot of unique handcrafted stuff here at the Renaissance Festival. Mm -hmm. And you paid dearly for it. Raccoonicorn, the magical trash panda. Hey, I know that guy. I did the archery last year. I killed it, if I do say so myself. You might disagree. We don't think we saw this shop here last year. Oh, that's really cool. Grikles. And I must buy a sword. Again, I don't know why, but I want one. We've got the black dragon over here. All kinds of cool dragon artwork. Just unique stuff you don't find anywhere else, obviously. Pretty much every year, we also buy a mix here for, for dips. They're really, really good. And as you can tell by the sign, you get free samples. So you get to try them all before you buy them. But folks, what you may not know is that when it comes to the merchandise,
ourselves, we are not like the other acts out here. Die! And right at the end, you actually have the opportunity to see some live mermaids here at the Renaissance Festival. And just like they advertised, right here, we have a live mermaid. I know it looks like an old diving helmet, but it's not. It does, it looks like a scuba. Oh, a scuba hat. A scuba hat. Yes, yes, we call them scuba hats. Very good. I Sarah has found interest in the puppet show. And I guess we have some medieval furniture displays here. I'm not really sure. So tomorrow we'll be sober and we'll be like you. There is the one drinks whiskey neat and goes to bed at first light. Here's the one drinks whiskey neat and goes to bed at first light. She is the life of every piece. She is the life of every piece. Here we have the queen. Why don't you cry about it? I'm planning on it! Then you'll become flowing water. That was kind of cool. I don't think we've ever seen that before. I think we were supposed to bow. Whoops. Glass blowing shop. They actually have a glass blowing demonstration as well. If you're interested in the iced tea set, it's only $300. We are just amazed at the lack of crowds right now. We have never actually just walked through here without like dodging people. Yeah, like it's sometimes hard to walk through. There's just so many people, and we're just casually strolling right on through. And it's 5.30 and the sun's about to set. <laughs> Not bad. I know it looks semi-crowded still, but compared to other years that we've been here, this is nothing. Even at the end of the day, walking through here is usually a nightmare and there is tons of space. We're loving this. Here we have the gray house. Is there anything better than these cute little dogs right here? Oh my gosh. Sarah has found a nice jewelry store here. So I think we're going to pick her something out.
just like that. Weird. And just as fast as we got here, we are now leaving. Another great year at the Carolina Renaissance Festival. We got to see everything we really wanted to see. Just walk around, do some people watching. Obviously, one of the funnest things you can do here is just see all the fun people. Everybody's really enjoying themselves, being themselves. Uh, we got to enjoy some nice food, some drinks, see some shows, walk around, look at all the cool handcrafted merchandise. I don't know, it was just a really fun time. Did you have a good time? It was fun. We had a good time. Thank you guys so much for joining us in today's video. Like always, if you don't mind, give us a big thumbs up when you hit when you watch this, if you do enjoy it. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. Bye.